Okay, quick part two. Um, so this is more so to my clients that um, have worked with me. You know, I always tell you to advocate for your dog's space and just, uh, you know, make sure, be selective about who you let pet your dog, etc. And that's exactly for that reason, right? You never know what can happen. At the end of the day, these are dogs. The bigger problem is that people don't know how to properly pet dogs. So unless you have someone who you can trust, who will follow your instructions, this is why I say just be cautious because at the end of the day, it's our dog that'll pay the price. That person who's getting in the way of your training or who's putting your dog at risk, they don't give a shit about you or your dog, right? So you have to advocate for your dog. You have to keep your dog safe in this crazy world. So I know some of you think, oh my God, it's so restrictive. Why can't I just let my dog say hi to every dog in person? Well, this is why, because you never know what could happen and then that person can very quickly turn on you and now you have an issue on your head. So just be cautious and advocate for your dog and their space.